LeBron James, will Lakers star play in Kings rematch tonight? Latest injury update? LeBron has missed two straight games since picking up his train, which an MRI scan revealed is only minor, much to LA's relief. But the Lakers have lost on both occasions without their talisman, losing by a point to the Kings in Sacramento and then going down to the Lou Williams-inspired LA Clippers at Staples Center. That was despite owning double-digit leads in both contests. The Lakers have slipped to sixth in the Western Conference with a 2016 record as a result and the Kings will match that if they win in Southern California, 6.30 p.m. PST, 2.30 m UK time. Four-time MVP LeBron's recovery has been managed on a day-to-day -day basis since his injury. But unfortunately for Luke Walton and CEO they will have to try and snap their two-game losing streak without the 34-year-old, who celebrates his birthday today. LeBron, Michael Beasley and Regen Ronto, who recently underwent surgery on a sprained right finger, are all unavailable while Yavale McGee remains questionable due to illness having missed the last seven nights. Yet while the Lakers, who face the second of a four-match home run tonight, are without LeBron and veteran point guard Ronto, Walton insists the team can cope. He said, I know we can get through it, Walton said. I know it's not going to be easy, but I know and believe in the guys that we have. I thought at Sacramento we played a game on the road against a good team that we should have won. Friday, we had a 10-point lead late in the third. I know that's not winning, but I believe the team we have can get it done. We just have to do a couple things a little bit better. With the Lakers just 4.5 games ahead of the 14th placed New Orleans Pelicans, Lonzo Ball, who has performed well in an increased role of late, has implored the team to stick together. That's after they allowed the joint longest unanswered run of points in the NBA this season when the Clippers went on a 22-0 stretch that led to boos from the home fans. Ball said, LeBron and Ronto, obviously are both our leaders. They were trying to talk to us as best they could, from the sidelines, but it's not the same as being out there guys were getting frustrated. Anytime a team goes on a 22-0 run, it's not going to be all fine and dandy. We have got to regroup. We can't argue with each other. We're on the same team. So, we just got to step up and accept the roles that we're coming into right now. We went on a win streak last time, we struggled. We've got to go on another one this time.